Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology Channel. And if you have a Apple device, it's time to check for updates as Apple has released a update, a security update for the first zero day of 2024. So this is the first exploited in the wild attack uh, that exists right now. Uh, Apple does say that it's extremely important to update your devices to uh, patch. It's a flaw that is in the WebKit development package. And what happens is that a carefully crafted web page could actually uh, escalate the, um, the user to an admin and uh, be able to, of course, execute whatever code they want on affected devices. So the uh, update is for iPhone 8, 8 Plus, iPhone 10, iPad 5, fifth generation, iPad Pro 9.7 inch, iPad Pro 12.9 inch, first generation, the uh, iPhone 10s and later, iPad Pro 12.9 inch, second generation later, iPad Pro 10.5 inch, iPad Pro 11 inch, first generation later, iPad Air third generation later, iPad sixth generation and later, iPad mini fifth generation and later, Macs that are running macOS Monterey and later, and of course, Apple TV HD and the Apple TV 4K models need to be updated to make sure that you don't get that zero-day exploit on your device. It seems to be a, a limited and very targeted attack, so it's possible that the attack was meant for specific groups. But since it's out there, uh, anybody can use it, and probably everybody can know about it. So that means that it's simple. Uh, just make sure that you update your Apple devices to stay safe. To fix the first zero-day flaw of Apple devices in 2024, which once again shows that whatever you are running in operating system and devices, all of them get security updates. All of them have security flaws. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe. Give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.